Welcome back to the Dominic Dahl Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Sam Murray. Join now with Stevenson Men's Ice Hockey Head Coach Dominic Dahls and Coach. Rough weekend last weekend, fall in overtime to Brockport, and then fall to eighth-ranked Geneseo, one of the top-scoring offenses in the country. I guess one of the positive things you can take away is last week, three games, you did score 11 goals. How do you keep the offensive momentum going while also cleaning things up on the defensive end? Well, I, I mean, I think I, we talked about a little bit late last week of just we're starting to get to spaces more, and I, I think that is what's helping us create a little bit more of opportunity, and that's when we, we weren't scoring goals or struggling to score goals. That's We just we weren't getting to the net. We weren't strong on our sticks, and we're doing a little bit better job at that, so I think that's where the offensive production comes from uh, this weekend however the it was the defense that kind of got the best of us I mean we've been pretty good all year long in terms of being a, a defensive team and, and and taking pride in that and um, I think it just got away from us a little bit defensively through the first one and a half years in the program never allowed 50 shots against uh, after the new year this year twice you've allowed 50 goals against how do you you know, limit the pucks, amount of pucks that Caffrey sees in the game? Well, I mean, that Brockport game was like a track meet. I, I, that was, a, I, I think, a, a unique game in terms of just the way both teams were, were playing. It was very, very back and forth. A lot of shots off the attack. The teams didn't really possess the puck on either side a, a lot. Um, so I think that's where a lot of the, the shots come. Because then you look at the next night, um, I mean, Geneseo is a much better team than, than Brockport, I think. And, um, you know, that was more of them possessing the puck, controlling the puck. And I, so I think that's where a lot of the shots and opportunity came from. Um, you know, for us in terms of, of limiting them, I, I mean, it's we've done, a, I think, a pretty decent job. We've outshot most of our opponents all year. Um, it's just going to be a matter of, you know, on a given night, what type of shots or special teams I think all adds into the equation. Yeah. We flip the page to this week. Back in conference play, two road games. You face Lebanon Valley and Chatham, two teams you saw earlier on the year, you know, won seven to one in both those games. But it's later in the season, it's gonna be a different matchup this this time around. Yeah, I mean we talked about it yesterday in the in the locker room. Um I mean Lebanon Valley's they've beat Utica, they beat Elmira, I mean they've beat almost everybody they've played. So they're having a pretty um, a pretty good year and a pretty good second half here so far. So um, we're going to have to make sure that we're ready, prepared. It's, it's going to be a good hockey game, and um, we need to be ready for that. It's a it's a big a, a big weekend for us. You know, it's an opportunity to um, you know we obviously get back into conference play, so um, compete for what our what our goals are and, and turn the page here from a from a rough weekend. But we're going to have to we're going to have to compete if and that's going to be you know that's kind of been our backbone here when we've done well and if we're not competing we're gonna we're gonna struggle well coach we wish you the best of luck this weekend we'll see you back here next week thank you for coach dominic dolls i'm sam murray and this has been the dominic doll show